Hi. Let's learn about cyclical stocks. A cyclical stock is a stock that's price is affected by macroeconomic or systematic changes in the overall economy. For example, when the economy is doing well, people can afford to buy new cars, upgrade their homes, shop, and travel. But when the economy does poorly, these discretionary expenses are some of the first things consumers cut. Companies that have cyclical stocks include car manufacturers, airlines, furniture retailers, clothing stores, hotels, and restaurants. Cyclical stocks rise and fall with the economic cycle. They seem predictable in their movement and some investors attempt to time the market by buying shares at a low point in the business cycle and selling them at a high point. However, Investors should use caution about the weight of cyclical stocks in their portfolios at any given point in time. It doesn't mean investors should steer clear of these stocks completely. Cyclical stocks are viewed as more volatile than non-cyclical or defensive stocks but offer greater potential for growth because they tend to outperform the market during periods of economic strength. Investors frequently choose to use exchange-traded funds to gain exposure to cyclical stocks while expanding economic cycles. The SPDR ETF series offers one of the most popular cyclical ETF investments in the Consumer Discretionary Select Sector Fund, XLY. The performance of cyclical stocks tend to correlate with the economy, while the same can't be said about non-cyclical stocks, also called defensive stocks. Adding non-cyclical stocks to a portfolio can be a great strategy for investors as it helps hedge against losses sustained from cyclical companies during an economic slowdown. Cyclical stocks are further delineated by durables, non-durables, and services. Durable goods companies are involved in the manufacture or distribution of physical goods that have an expected lifespan of more than three years. Non-durable goods companies produce or distribute soft goods that have an expected lifespan of fewer than three years. Services is a separate category of cyclical stocks because these companies provide services that facilitate travel, entertainment, and other leisure activities for consumers. Here are three key takeaways. 1. Cyclical stocks are affected by macroeconomic changes, where its returns follow the cycles of an economy. Two. Cyclical stocks are generally the opposite of defensive stocks. Cyclical stocks include discretionary companies, such as Starbucks or Nike, while defensive stocks are staples, such as Campbell Soup. 3. Cyclical stocks usually have higher volatility and are expected to produce higher returns during periods of economic strength. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.